all right what's up guys mr telescope here again with a, another video uh this one i know it's been a while uh it was supposed to have an angel one that was supposed to come up but this is a a video that's probably gonna come up on the day this card gets banned monday uro uro my boy if i could there you go float you up this card is not going to be legal in the following formats uh, uh it's not going to be following in historic pioneer modern and maybe legacy because this card is fucking nuts so it's getting banned uh with that was teased in a secret layer uh i was trying to work on a yorian deck a five color yorian deck as you can see a bunch of fun stuff i don't want to go over everything i've made my choices on everything that's in here i think it's pretty decent uh, i wouldn't say it's the best i say it's fun definitely fucking fun um shit ton of lands i think it's 35 yeah 35 some people do 37 i do 35 it's a lot a lot of lands 35 so there's 80 cards in here 35 is gonna be like 40 percent almost it's like 48 per 46 percent or something shit like that. it's a lot of lands uh, but there's a bunch of cool stuff in here. Cool additions, World Tree. Um, it is a best of three sideboard deck. Uh, cool sideboard. Bro, how'd you get it? Uh, I just kind of threw cards in here. Uh, I did this intro like once or twice already. Uh, I'm going to hop into just traditional horse historic ranked. Um, I lost to a, a cycling deck because I wanted to fucking cry. Uh, no, I lost because uh, I just didn't get lands. The... the I got lands, right? I have five lands, but they were only green and red. It's fucking weird. Um, the world trees in here, there's only two of them. I wasn't really too impressed with the card. I tried four, wasn't too happy. I've seen a few other people try to do some Nivy Mizzy shit, but uh, uh, we'll see how it goes. We're in the dizzying heights of silver. Ah, uh, not silver. Uh, what is this? Plat? I think it's plat. <gasps> Ugh, plat two. Uh, cards, lands, sure. Uh, yeah. We'll get the shock land out first. Wait a minute, are you playing five color Yorian too? wonder what kind of deck he's playing. I want to see something he's not expecting to see coming. Uh, I have black. I can do... If I actually... If I... If I shock this in. And then I do blue. I go like this. We get to... Look at his hand. Um... That's going to be a pain in the ass. We don't want that. Um, then I explore. Put an additional land. This has black in it, right? And I go like this. And we just say, fuck you in particular, my guy. Uh, we just get to say thank you. Have a nice day. That was fucking hot. Collective company on your turn? Oh shit, he's going deep. Oh, it's the Selesnia deck. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. I, I vibe, I vibe. Um, I could draw a shit. I could draw a f Make a 4-4 four, four flyer. Actually, I think I'm just going to go over. Yeah, and then we'll just slap a land down. Uh, I think we can do some, some pretty cute shit with Yorian and him.
just take the hit. It's free life. I'm not. Not worried. Um. So if I go like this. Oh, I did this out of order. I should have grabbed. Uh, uh, what color do I want? I want. So I have white, green, black, blue, red. Uh, I want a green then. And I go like this. And I look for this guy. I grab him. And I go like this. I draw five cards. Going to take... Thought Erasure or Ashiok? I could... I could probably Thought Erasure this turn. If I Growth Spiral, right? Hope, I, I'm praying I hit a land. We get there every time. Oh, it enters tap, though. Fuck. Now we have a fucking big, beefy, nivy mizzy. A nivy mizzy? For me? Tee hee? Yup, yeah, sure. You got it, chief. Path to the world tree? That's crazy. I'll show you my path to the world tree. Um, we want... Doesn't matter. We'll take red. Um, I should have... Actually, I should swing in before I start doing shit. Bring him to the hand. I'm gonna play binding. Just all permanents. I'm gonna grab my boy to ferry. Um, I think we kind of just want this. Get rid of that. Get rid of one of those, one of those in. I get rid of the one veto. I guess it would be cute. I think we actually something like that. I think something like that's a little bit better. Not a hundred percent sure. I'm not the greatest at best of three sideboarding. I want. I usually try to do it if I make it to mythic and I practice doing best of three. Oh fuck! That's a bad hand. That's a hand. Yeah, sure. I won't be able to cast this.
This is trick A. Black. Sacrifice a creature. Sorry, I got real quiet because I started thinking because I saw I, I saw Stone Cold Serpent. I was like, "Fuck! How the fuck am I gonna deal with that?" And then I forgot. Angrass Rampage is target player sacrifice. Damn, that's just um. I think we just round out our colors. Oh, I should have grabbed another black land. I think we have to sacrifice the fairy here to stay alive. Or... I forgot this wasn't an X zero. That's what I figured. Oh, he hit two. Oh, he hit nothing. That's what you get for playing collective company in an 80 card deck, you fucking buffoon. He's got nothing but protection in his hand. Oh, no. Taking a beating, but we're going to stabilize here. So I think we stabilized. We're in control. He has two lands. We have eight. Good game. Well, we didn't have eight. We had seven. My bad. My dumbass. So that was a fun one. That was fun. Um, sideboarding, I'm a little, I'm still really trying to figure out sideboarding. I think my sideboard is fine. Uh, I like, I've been trying to get more into best of three because, uh, best of one is super toxic and just horrible. Uh, in best of three, I've noticed you don't really see a lot of the fucking cheese strat strats because like the cheese strats are like, oh yeah, you want to win by shock. You know what I mean? You want to win by something that opponent doesn't expect. And you want to win by, like, kind of cheesing your opponent and winning, like, the fact that you don't get a chance to sideboard. Fuck, again? Another one lander? His hand's gas, though. If I could get rid of, like, Dovin and Ashiok, his hand would be pretty fucking sick. Or... Mulligan. 
sure. We'll get rid of Clothis. Or I can cast. No, I can't. Yeah, I can't. No, I can't. I want to keep their double removal. So when you shake it like that, then you move it like that. Oh, that is a beautiful. I love that. That's pretty as fuck. Oh, I'm playing against Gruul. Oh, Gruul dinosaurs? That's kind of sick. Uh, we want this one. I want red and I want black. Oh, I got really scared for a second. I thought auto tapper fucking just ended my whole life. This card, these two are sick together. Ugh! Do I... I think I just... Well, first I swing in. And I bring out the Nivy Miz. I think I take that. Hmm. still in it. Uh, this comes in because creatures. Uh, da, 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 da. I'm going second. I'm gonna spot removal work more. I think. I think big removal comes out. Um, I don't think they're gonna have too much. So where's where's my veto? Veto's gonna come out. Um, controlly matchup. I think Clarion's kind of bad, but. Do I get rid of Clarion to put more single target removal in? I think that's actually pretty good. Solar Blaze is fine. And I need to cut one more thing. I guess we are going second, so Thought Eraser isn't as good. I think that's fine. 
I guess I could have cut a Casualties of War, because I don't think they're going to have much other than just, like, creature land, so hitting two things is kind of bad. Unless they have a Whatley. I think that's her name. Whatley, the dinosaur. Also, didn't I go second that game? So, like, I'm kind of feeling hot right now. Um... That's not good enough. This is better. Kind of. I think I ditched the Thought Erasure since it's only one color. Oh no, don't do it to me again. I'm playing that fucking... Green. I got the all the red and green lands right now. So I'm going to need a shock in, which is going to be a bitch. I think they're just a little too slow. Cause I have... I need a blue, right? Because... I wonder if that was a mistake. I think it was a mistake. What I should have done is I should have kept the mana open to transform Valky into a... Because this is going to be lethal right here, actually. Um, Why couldn't I block? That was really weird. I I think <sighs> that was very weird and frustrating to be honest right then and there. Um Now we just have a demonstrable advantage cuz we're going first. I'm going to keep and I'm going to just fucking punish the fuck out of them now. I just I'm I'm so mad. I I wanted the block. Were they? It wasn't black. It had no. They it had protection from blue. So I should have been able to block the five four. But that's something you don't forget is that Valky can transform. I that, that new card. We'll, we'll blame it on that new card. Not used to the format. Uh, he's thinking. So I wonder if he has kept a iffy hand. Oh, God. I don't like playing on this map just because of the fucking sound effects. So that was a great turn because I was able to explore, put this down. Uh, Maelstrom's pulse is going to be hot. But I think I'm actually going to play her next turn. I might shock her, shock in to play her.
I what can I grab next turn? I can grab Oath of Kaya next turn and kind of punish with a non like specific removal. Well, I just I'm gonna have to maelstrom that. Which is kind of unfortunate. Now, it is unfortunate that we're not drawing lands. We are at about a 49, which I think is should be good since we've seen four. That means we're at the average spot. Oh, this is very unfortunate. We are not seeing lands. I would have liked to... Lotus Cobra and play Maelstrom, but uh, he's seeing all his sauce right now. And we are not seeing our sauce. I'm going to die. That was very unfortunate. Uh, we dominated the fuck out of the first game. Uh, second game, we just bricked on lands for two turns. Uh, that's a haster coming in. I can't actually properly block this time. Um, gives it trample. I forgot about that. Bow, 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 bow. We're at one. Cool. Um, and then we just lose. Yep. Too little too late. Fuck, dude. That was so frustrating. We dominated the fuck out of the first game, but we just threw it away the second two uh the second one i lost because i misplayed second round i lost because i misplayed third one because i we just didn't hit the lands but that's to be expected we are playing an 80 card deck you know it's just one of the things you know you will get magic every once in a while be about every one in four games you'll get fucking land fucked but if you win so hear me out right if you have a three and four record in one in four games you're gonna get mana fucked you know it balances out you just gotta make sure the game you get mana fucked is the game you lose. Um, this is fine. Turn two thought eraser. Uh, we're dependent on lands, but I I am going to surveil next turn. So. So boom, and we also do have two draws, two draws and a surveil. So, we should theoretically be okay. Yeah, there it is. So we're, if we don't see a land, we're going to get that off the top of our library. So, uh, Uro, not too worried about, you may play land cards from your graveyard, not too worried about. I am, I do have a lot of spells and I don't want them to cost more. We're going to have to get rid of that because we want to see another land. We, we can't, we need to see more lands and that's just the fact of the matter. That's fine. I don't care. Play another land. I have. I'm going into next turn. I have removal. I can play on anything that they play. So, um, I think we diversify our color portfolio. I think actually I'm going to put him in my hand because it's just getting ready for a turn uh, five would be nice. That's fine. It's slow, mopey. I, if he only plays one creature, I can make him sacrifice it. Place two, which is fine. Uh, we are going to... Do I want to thin my library? I think I'm just going to... Sacrifice a creature. Just get rid of one of those. Which one you want to get rid of? Ooh, ooh. That's fine. I don't know what he ha what he has in his hands for gas, but it's probably not too good. Thoughtseize! Fuck! My Captain Siaya. If he doesn't get rid of Captain Siaya, I... Siasi? Siasi? He's a lunatic if he doesn't.
I guess an interesting... Yeah, okay. Yeah, I wonder if an interesting play would have been to play the say, uh, s Captain last turn. The fuck? What it could have destroyed two of my lands. No, 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 no. Oh, okay, okay. Interesting. That's not white. That's white. Keep your ghost quarters out of here, please. ANOTHER GHOST QUARTERS, NO! WHAT THE FUCK?! I think I block here. Yeah. Because he can't play... Is it five cards or four? Oh, I guess he can. I get, Then I just time wipe, I guess, and it gets rid of another ghost quarters from the... So, my plan is, right, put a stop in my uh, beating on my upkeep. I'm going to Maelstrom Pulse uh, before this triggers. I'm going to uh, kill his Uro.
So I'm going to... Yeah. Uh, but my thought process next turn was... Uh, I think this is going to be good. Because Uro's here. Uh, I think... I don't think that's going to be good. Casualties is not too hot. Let's be honest. So let's, uh, let's get rid of casualties. If I can scroll down to it. Uh, casualties of war. This is probably going to be pretty spicy. And Ashiok's going to be kind of hot. Um, maybe B Devil comes out, and then but Devil and do I get rid of another two drop? No, all those were kind of fire. I think Knight of Autumn come out. Because I don't, I don't, I don't really, there's not really a target for Knight of Autumn to hit, it seems like, in his deck. I'm not hitting any enchantments, there's not a lot of, like, I don't really need another threat. Uh, I think grabbing Uro would be kind of hot with Valky. Gotta remember that he's, at that point, it's only three mana to transform him, so then it turns Valky into a turn two, grab your Uro, turn three, have my own 6-6 six, six Uro on the battlefield, swing in, gain three life, draw a card. Uh, which is fucking nuts. I personally think since Valky's here, uh, I don't think Uro is a problem anymore, because it, it, you get super duper mega punished if uh, uh, you play Uro and the opponent's playing about uh, a Valky. So I think it turns black into a fucking monster of a house, because it's like, alright, creature deck, um... Yeah, I could have a lot of mana here. It's a little slow, but... Okay, hold on, wait. If I play Lotus Cobra first, I create three mana. Well, if I do... What a bitch of a card. That card is fucking brutal. I can still kill it, but it's gonna cost me.
Sorry, I'm just thinking here, like, uh, um... Resolve, sure. Take a row. Max, and turn. <sighs> Want a cocoa? I can do it with my 6-6, six, six, bro. Sure. If he gets rid of Dovin, he's in... He's probably not thinking clearly. I don't have white mana. It's a Planeswalker, but it's not scary. Thought is probably a little bit scarier. Or explore, I guess. This is kind of getting annoying now. My odds are ever improving.
a little too late, Chief. We'll concede that one. That was very frustrating, uh, just because of that card not letting me do anything. Uh, maybe single target removal is something I keep in. I think Ashiok was just a little too slow there. It would have been nice, but it wouldn't have been cute. I think Knight of Autumn does come back in because I have that annoying enchantment. Um, actually, I think Ashiok just comes out, and I just run two unmoored egos, and I just fucking try to fucking yoke them. Uh, maybe one casualty, two casualties come back in, because that would have actually been th Crisis comes out, uh, along with a, because that really wouldn't have helped me at all. So I think that sideboarding is pretty decent, not 100% sure. Play first. Uh, this is a fucking slow-ass hand, but sure. We're going to get rid of this, because just in case he has that bird. Uh, we're going to go grab a black land. Oh, my unmoored ego. So we're slowly filling out the profile. I think I'm missing. Nope, I got the bed. I'm not searching, I'm looking at the top, right? Yeah. So that's fine. Would suck if he has a ghost quarters. be a red in the top. Take action. No. You're such a fucking bitch! I hate you! Avian Mind Sensor, bro. What a fucking card, bro. I didn't even know this card existed. If an opponent would search your library, that player searches the top four cards of their library instead, which is just brutal because I'm playing 80 cards. Like, this card just shuts us down. And they're just grabbing ghost quarters? This is nuts! It's so frustrating. I think we just concede to that. Like, this, this deck was built to just punish us. Take action. Luckily, I hit an island. Pass. 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 Search library. Decline. Pay two. 
Get the fuck out of my face. Next. No attacks and turn. <sighs> You're fucking pussy, bro. Ugh! I got lucky. So mad. Do I protect Kaya or do I let her die? Pass. I'll let Kaya die. I got too involved with local. Because Ghost Quarters is brutal, right? Ghost Quarters is a brutal land. Cycle, yeah, it's fine. I will block here to protect my Teferi. Keep up the pace. Fine, whatever. His avian, avian? No, it's not a even avian. Avian mind sensor. Even, avian. A v e n. Avon. Take action. I will lose to fairy here, and that's fine by me. Because I get a Uro. Go for it. Oh, I'm out of basics.
her? That's all you, honey boo boo child. You could take whatever you want out of my hand. Uh, honestly, I'm just gonna probably play Tammy next turn. And bounce back something. Pass. Yup, that's how that works, honey. Rorschach's vision. More like Schmorshag's vision. How many ghost cores have you seen? Uh, I think two so far, so there should be a few more. No, he's seen three. There should be one more in his deck. No, not one more. Uh, we're going to go like. Oh man, I forgot because of that. Your talents are worth cataloging. I have learned much from my ancestors. Oof, I think I might have thrown. No, we can... Two... Four, five. Surprised I haven't seen any premium removal right now. Just kind of frustrating. Do I have a red yet? No. Coco. Four, four.
Um, tell me what you want, what you really, really want. Now, tell me what you want, what you really, really want. What a, what a, I played this game so bad. Just thinking about it. I misplayed like eight times. Thinking if he arrows, exiles four, he can hit nothing besides lands. So you get like one, two, three. Oh, he can't. He'll hit a lot of lands. So he'd hit at least two lands. Sure. Okay, I give my deck a good shuffle. by me. Yeah, I'm gonna have to say fine by me. Uh, I can play Oath, Clothis. What other threat is there in the deck? I could get Knight of the Reliquary. Thoughtseize, he's probably gonna hit my Unmoored, but I wouldn't really care about Unmoored. I'd worry about me gaining life. I don't know, Unmoored was probably a good call. I, I don't know his deck well enough. I can see his whole thing. Uh, I, I could actually hit Ghost Quarters. Which is a big, uh, big no-no. I can play that. I can hit that. Gain three life. I can make a big old creature. And then I can hit... Assassin's Trophy. Your library, get rid of that. Leave graveyard, bow bow. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. Okay. Kind of reached the point where I'm pretty stable. Whew, that was a close matchup. I played like complete and utter dog shit. But I should be able to pressure him now pretty well at least. Uh, let me bring up that. I still have a lot of lands left in my deck. We're at about almost a 50-50. Yeah, okay. He was thinking... Got rid of his main win con, Uro. I think uh, uh, this deck is a very good counter to our deck, but I don't know how it would play without Uro. I don't know what you put in that 3-drop win con spot to actually win the game. Uh, oh my god, this is a long recording. We're going to stop there. Holy shit. 
Uh, if you, it's fun deck to pilot. I'll, I'll put the uh, put it put it up here. Uh, I, it's super duper fun. Uh, it's it takes a little bit of thinking. Uh, you play a lot of fun cards, uh, especially like in the sideboard too. You just got a lot of cool shit. You, it's also just not like my favorite thing is it's not really. There's not like a dominance of one set. Like we got Kyle Time, we got the the one thing, we got fucking uh, Zendikar, we got War of the Spark, we got Ravnica, we got another War of the Spark, we got Ravnica again, War of the Spark, War of the Spark. Oh, hold on, wait, Ravnica, uh, Historic, Theros, Ravnica Allegiance, Ravnica Allegiance again, Kaldesh, Kaldheim, War of the Spark. Oh, uh. Blah, blah, blah. Another War of the Spark. Dominaria. War of the Spark. Kaldheim. Kaldheim. War of the Spark. War of the Spark. Okay, hold on, wait. Maybe it's just War of the Spark and... Wait, what about the sideboard? Man, fuck. I don't know. It's got a lot of sets. It's got a lot of sets. Don't listen to me. Um, I'm gonna... I might edit this video. It is an hour. Or I might just jam it. But, uh... It was fun. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed.